Innovation is the cornerstone of success in America. In order to compete in the global marketplace, businesses and individuals are continuously striving to stay ahead of the game. I'm Terry Bradshaw. You know, from emerging technologies and financial strategies to the latest healthcare developments, you would be surprised by the many factors coming into play. Welcome to Today in America. Economic development is all about building healthy economies in order to have healthy communities. Let's discover the ways in which some of our nation's cities and towns are stimulating industrial and commercial growth. Small rural communities trying to find ways to remain relevant in the 21st century can sometimes find it a daunting task. It clearly requires the participation of all of its residents, a buy-in of the entire community. A perfect example can be found along the interstate highway between Dallas and Oklahoma City. Welcome to Ardmore. Sprouting initially as a mere stop on the Santa Fe Railroad before Oklahoma was even a state, Ardmore now has a population just under 25,000, but sits amid approximately 6 million people within a 50-mile radius. Ardmore offers the best of both rural and urban life. In Ardmore, we're a real community. We have a community spirit, a unique quality of life that's really different from anywhere else. Our community is free of traffic, smog, and crime. We're very a can-do kind of a community that uh, has a unique quality about it that you don't find anywhere else. Ardmore now finds itself a significant hub for production, distribution, and logistics. The city currently hosts a number of distribution centers for companies like Best Buy, Dollar General, and Dot Foods, while manufacturers such as Michelin, Valero, East Jordan Ironworks, and Dragon also call Ardmore home. Recently, a technology and research cluster has developed. Noble Foundation, one of the world's largest agricultural and plant biology research firms, has been joined by Southwest Silicon Technologies and Amethyst Research. Ardmore's location makes it the perfect choice for distribution centers, and the Ardmore Development Authority has done a great job of bringing those type of employers here. That with the natural resources, energy companies want to be here. We've also got a great uh, partner in Michelin, North America, who is our community's largest employer. The city's airport hosts a designated foreign trade zone featuring intermodal facilities for rail, truck, and air transport, including wide-body freight aircraft. Oklahoma's pro-business climate and low operating costs are among the top 10 in the country. Life in the Ardmore area is so fun. It is so beautiful here, and it is just a wonderful family community. People that I know who have moved off and come back and raised their families here, I've chosen to do that as well, from the uh, arts in the area to the uh, uh, theater to the music that we have. Uh, just wonderful facilities that I love that my children get to grow up with, and that's why I chose to move back and raise my family here in Ardmore. Residents and visitors alike appreciate this area's natural assets, which include parks, hiking and riding trails, as well as eight lakes accessible within a 20-minute drive of Ardmore. For those interested in exploring the Earth's history recorded in stone, some of the nation's oldest rock formations are found in this area. We have an exceptional future ahead of us in Ardmore. A uh, recent uh, uh, visioning process in Ardmore established initiatives that uh, include a regional cancer center, uh, the expansion of higher education in Ardmore, the addition of parks, trails, and enhancements to our downtown area. With the can-do spirit that we have in Ardmore, I would say that Ardmore is really second to none. Considered one of the most progressive cities in Oklahoma, Ardmore's leaders and citizens work in concert to improve their community. Residents of Ardmore choose to live here instead of a big city because of intangible but nevertheless important qualities, notably peace of mind, a feeling of community, and a sense of control over one's own life.